A big thanks to all of my Patreon supporters. And a big thanks to all of these donators of $5 or more. Brian D0313. Dead Zergling. Radio Raptor. And Vlad Tepish3176. You all helped make these episodes possible. Howdy, insufferable gaming fans. Your old pal Rosser here, back for some more Shadowrun. Well, as usual, my great fans have told me some hints that I was not aware of during the uh, off time. So now I will try to enact some of them. For instance, one thing I didn't know well, this wasn't uh, a hint, this is just me reading the instructions. The uh, Colt L36 pistol has the exact same power as the one I had in the first place, so that was kind of useless. Also, could have saved a ton of money by killing King instead of paying him. It's possible that I can go back and kill him and recoup some of my losses. Um, aside from that, you know, other things that will come up in the future. And hopefully, I will get to try some of them out. So, I guess the first thing I want to do is... what? I want to find out if it is possible... with the... holy crap. Possible with the stuff I have now to... hack some money out of some computers. Also, apparently, if my dudes die in combat, I can bring them back. So, I don't need to worry so much about that. In theory. Also, I can order them around to go places and do things. If I am so inclined to do such a thing. Ha! Got him. I really kind of was hoping I'd get some money out of all of that, but it uh, didn't happen. Let's just heal right on up. Get some healing there. Get some healing here. See? Fun fun. Now, where was that train station? Because I want to go back to the first area and try to um, pick up some money and stuff that I have missed out on along the way. I believe I'm heading back in the correct direction. Yeah, this looks about right. So we'll just take a couple of quick um, train rides. Yes, train ride. That's the uh, that's the series of words I was looking for. I hope. Now, if it seems like I've been very confused, it's because I am very confused. But that's okay. Because, you know, every every time I hit a new major milestone in this game, it makes me feel a little bit better. Let's see, then we need to take this one back. Because... I want to start in the starting area and see if I can get into The Matrix. Now remember, Shadowrun came out way before the movie The Matrix, so... You know, it's, it's not Shadowrun ripping off the popular movie that had zero sequels. Ahem. But rather, it is... A case of it just being a good name for computer stuff. There's no computer in here. I need to start by going back to my home building, I think. Which was located somewhere. Somewhere, of course, being the perfect place to locate anything. I knew I should have gone up that alleyway. But I didn't. I don't brain things very well. Right. Let's just uh, shoot some guys, because why wouldn't we? 
Now this is either going to be incredibly helpful or a huge disaster. If I can get it to work. We're gonna find out. Okay. Doesn't look like I can use these. Or can I? Let's find out. Use the cyber deck. On. Nope. Okay, it'll have to be a computer that I'm able to highlight, apparently. Or possibly a vid phone. Let's see if I can use it on this vid phone. I'm not using it on that. Okay, well, suit yourself. As long as I'm here, might as well heal up and save, because I haven't done that for a while. Let's see what my karma looks like. Ooh, seven. What would I like to get with that? You know, the more firearm skills I get, the more accurate my hits are, so... That definitely needs to go up. Right then. I feel better now. I don't feel good about not being able to find anything to use that cyber deck on. That is very lame. And all these doors are locked. Hmm, maybe I need to, um... Maybe I need to... Hmm, guess not. That's alright. I'll find something somewhere that will, um, help me recoup some of my cash losses. I hope. That's the dream. No, oh, you're not coming in, huh? Let's see how it is. Quickly look around here. Um, I don't see any computer stuff, and that door's locked. Okay, so maybe, possibly, I'm wasting some time here. I am at peace with that, however. So, not gonna complain. We've still got several more buildings to check. This one, for instance. Anything in here, other than a buttload of file cabinets. Nope. And none of those computers seem to be highlightable. Wait a minute, what's this? Nope, nothing. You know, I gotta kinda wonder. Yep, I still have that paperweight. That meteoric iron paperweight. Which I still don't know what it does. Um... There's a computer. Hell yeah. I can just walk right in, right? I mean, that's not a problem. I hope. You don't mind, do you? Hey, it's working! Alright. Now, I've got to figure out how this works, because I did not really read that much in the instructions. Um... I don't know what I'm doing. Found one, I see. Okay. Attacked by IC. Found one IC. Combat successful. Found two. What the hell does any of this mean? I heard that this was supposed to be like Minesweeper, but I don't really understand. Combat failed. Okay. Um, I guess I'm not finding anything in these spaces. So, can I, like, do something here? I received data. That's cool. I hit a button of some sort. Okay. So there's, like, three spaces around here. Combat failed. 
I'm about successful. And I got some more data. To what end, I have no earthly idea. I probably am doing this wrong. Combat failed. Combat failed. Alright. I probably just need to um, get the hell out of here before I die. How do I do that? Like that. Okay. Glutman account. A thousand new yen. Sweet! And a data file obtained. So... How can I look at the data file? Wow, there goes all of my health. Ah, here it is. Let's examine it. No side of your courier. Word on the street is that he got to Matrix Systems just before they were permanently shut down. Drake then sent a hit squad after him. Glutman. So this is also how we get more money and information. So this is good. This is very good. I'm going to need to um, up my... Whatchamacallit computer skills if I want to, you know, not die repeatedly. And that elevator's still out of order. I should probably just uh, go ahead and cast a heal spell here at this point. Good. I feel slightly less like I'm about to die. So now, I can go look for some more. Um, computers to hack. Perhaps there will be one in here. I like this. I like having these options opening up. I see computers. And I'm getting XP. At a slightly accelerated rate. Can I access this? Or this? Or maybe one of these? No. Ah, well. Let's see if I can... Well, first of all, heal me up again. Heal me up again. Thank you. Let's see if I can use it on this broken-ass vid phone. I may have already tried this way earlier. I do not know. Not using it on that. Okay, fine. And I probably can't jack into this while you're standing right there. But I haven't talked to him in a while, and I do have some um, new keywords that um, don't seem to be going anywhere at all. Eh, I don't really need a grenade right now. Head computer. Probably get him to uh, sell me some more slap patches if I wanted them. And one more. Okay. So nothing new there. Just um, running around looking for computers, like you do. There was a working phone here in this club, as I do seem to recall. So why don't we try it on this? Nope. No such luck. I wonder if there's anyone new I can talk to. I'll just uh, try that since I'm here. Sassy, Glutman, Talus? Who the hell's Talus? Oh, the talisman shop. Neat. How you doing? Guaranteed magic or your money back? Um, so, does this actually do anything for me, or...? Guess not. 
Oh well. That wasn't uh, as helpful as I had expected it to be, honestly. And I'm pretty sure there's no computers in the graveyard or that other club, at least not that I remember. So let's um, take out the sniper and head back to Area 2, the car yards. Wherein, I will attempt to uh, see if I can beat the samurai dude. So, one moment while I get back over that away. So, while I was walking around looking for new computers near the car yard, this happened. And my healer just took off. He's gone. That's not exactly good. So, here I am, with no healer, in a hostile environment, kinda near the car yard, but also near the shops, so I thought what I would do is take a quick look and um, see if I saw anything new that I could actually afford in here. So, how much money do I have? Alright, I have a thousand bucks. There is a black potion bottle for six thousand. And a blue and purple bottle for three thousand. Okay, I can't afford any of those. How are we looking at weapons? I need something better. Like, a fichetti is actually better than the weapon I have. That's 2,000. And the Defiance is a lot more. Mesh Wire Jacket would be good. Um, an Ares Viper would be good. And in here is a Ruger Warhawk, which would also be good. So if I can get to 2,000, I can at least get the next better weapon. So it looks like I'm going to have to go to the car yard and do some grinding for both uh, XP and cash. Which is fine, because, you know, there's a bed in the car yard. I would be able to... Who are you? A gang member, right. I would be able to uh, heal up when I get low on health, so... That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to the car yard, grind up some money, grind up some XP, and I will meet you back when it is time to make some purchases. One moment. Okay, got some levels, got some money, looked it up, made sure the weapon I want to buy is actually better than the one I have, and it is by a couple of points. So let's grab it. Yes, I am now better off than I was. Let us equip that now. Use it. I could probably sell the Colt now, but I think I'll hang on to it in case I get a party member who doesn't have anything, or if I run into a situation where my weapon gets taken away. So. I was thinking about it, and it suddenly occurred to me that in the pen and paper tabletop game Shadowrun, uh, Street Samurai is actually a character class. You can roll a character up that's a Street Samurai. I've never played one, so I don't know what their deal is, except that they're supposed to be like cleaning up the streets or living by a code of honor or something. I haven't actually played in a while, so... You know, right now the next big thing coming down the pipe is a Ravenloft campaign that I'll be playing in, if any of you are interested in, you know, pen and paper games. I'll be playing a monk who wrestles monsters. Like, not an actual monk, but a guy who was trained by monks. Like. He, he professional wrestles monsters, like, with suplexes and 
drop kicks and stuff. I'm looking forward to it. Alright, let's see if I can beat some more arena dudes at this point. Or if I am just spinning my wheels. Then, once we get done with that, we can find some more computers to hack. You there. Yes, I will fight in the arena against this guy. Samurai Warrior. Um, did he have a machine gun before? I guess he did. I feel like that was very difficult. But I just got 4,000 bucks. Hell yeah. So now it's time to save up and see who's next. Well, not so much save up as heal up. Also check my XP and see how close I am to getting some more uh, hit points. Because we all need more hit points. I have three, so not even close. I'll need like six or seven, roughly. I don't remember, remember if you have to, if the number is how many points you have to use or if it's one higher. I never can keep it straight. But that's okay, because I just made a buttload of cash. Could there be more? Time will tell. Yes, let's have another fight. Who is it this time? It's a ferocious orc. Ferocious Orc, whom I will attack repeatedly and hope for the best. You're out of your league, he says. He may be right. He may be right. 5,000. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I can afford plenty of stuff now. I can get some better armor, even bigger weapons. Hell yeah, magic stuff. I don't even know yet. I should probably wait until I know what the magic stuff is actually for before I go buying a bunch of it. At least that was the tip I was given. But, you know, I would like to at least stumble upon a healing spell, if at all possible. I think that would be really nifty keen. Anyone else? Who's next? Guy with who runs around real fast with the machine. Wow, I couldn't even get my crosshair on that dude. Yeah, I don't think I'm. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna be winning that one quite yet. Least ways not without some much better armor. So let's go armor shopping. Yay! Ah, wrong button. Wrong button, wrong button, wrong button. One moment. That's a little better. I hate it when games start you back on the start new game button when you clearly would want to continue. A bit of a hassle. But I can dig it. So, back to the armor shop. Weapon shop. Whatever. We will make this work. Oh, I should uh, talk to the doctor about that uh, cyberware also. I was told that the combat reflexes are really good. Something about doubling my attack rate or some such, which I can certainly get behind. So maybe we'll do that on this journey as well. All right. Where's that armor? And what is it? Uh, that's a grenade. It's the Ares Viper. And... Warhawk. I know there was armor around here. Yes, a wire mesh jacket. So how much money do I have? 9,000. I absolutely will buy the wire mesh jacket. Hopefully I won't regret it, but you know, that's the thing. If I do decide that I regret it later, I can always 
just. Um, you know, uh, what's what's the what are the words I'm looking for? Oh yeah, grind for money. Plus, I can probably sell this old armor. But do I want to sell it? No, I don't think I'll sell it. I'm just gonna keep it. Gonna keep it. Never know when you're gonna need a bitchin' leather jacket. Right. Anyway, to the newer-ish area. Yeah. That didn't go over so well for you there, did it, buddy? You shot at the wrong hombre. I'm loaded for bear. Ready to kick an ass or two. Yeah. Yeah, I'm almost certain I'll be going back to the arena. Before all is said and done. I'll do it for the money. Because why else would you fight in the arena? For the fame? For the glory? Sure, maybe. It's possible. I bet I'll be able to more easily fight these guys in this next area. Which I'm gonna have to, since I don't have any backup. That's a sobering thought. No backup and, um, no heals. Well, I'll just do the best I can with what I've got. If I start getting real low on hit points, we'll know I've made a terrible mistake. Speaking of a terrible mistake, these guys. It is a terrible mistake for me to be fighting them because they, I still don't seem to be hitting them. Worth a damn. Well, maybe worth a bit of a damn. I think my armor is doing some pretty good work right now. These guys are freaking slippery. I wish they dropped some cash. That would have been nice. I would have enjoyed it. Snowball's chance in hell, man. Messing, messing with me. Not good for you. Not good for your health. Can't be done. Shouldn't be done. Now what did you learn? Also, is there a computer around here anywhere? Because I am still, in fact, looking for the computer. I guess I can't just walk in. Um... Yes, you go see if that doctor is free. I guess all I had to do was politely ask for exactly what I wanted. Yes, I am looking much better, thank you for saying so. I've already checked his fridges, I think. Alright, now, what were these cyberwares? Skill software, and... Boosted reflexes. How much is it? 15,000? Holy shite! No, I can't afford that. How much is this? Uh, it's 3,000. It'll improve my leadership skills, which, you know what, I think I'm just gonna save my money for a little bit longer because I might want to hire some dudes to help me combat. Hey! Wow, look at the time. Gotta run. Really? Really run? Um, probably should have run in a more correct words direction. Wish there was some place to heal around here. I've yet to find one. But then again, I haven't really fully explored this area, so... Ah, piss off. Don't run me over with a car. Car. Don't run me over with one of yourselves. 
I am beat to shit. Seems typical. And this appears to be another graveyard. Ha! Ah. Yeah, that's right. I'm on the other side of a big old fence. This gate is locked. Do I have the key to this gate? Should I even try to open... That's uh, my room key for home. Yeah. Surprisingly enough, an iron key doesn't work on a bronze gate. You know, who knew? It might have worked. Hi, person. Where else we got? Just some uh, nice random alleyways. Don't walk directly in front of a firefight. You dumb assholes. That's a terrible way to stay alive. Are any of these hotels? This is the train station. Oh, finally, someone dropping a little bit of cash. I didn't think anyone was going to. So, you know, at least I can ride back and heal up, which I am absolutely going to have to do, and then after I do that I'll stop by the bar and see if anyone's hiring themselves out. A moment. And here I am back at Daily Station again. Oh, I don't know if there's anything else I can do to improve my odds of victory, but um, I think it's about time to try to progress. Now, I've heard a lot of talk around here about these Rust Stiletto fellows, so maybe it's time to go back into that alley. Speaking of alleys, this looks like a pretty good one. I should have brought some slap patches, but I didn't. That might be my downfall. If it is, you know, I'll buy some and come back. Great plan, right? That is a damn grenade. I am not going to fall for it. I guess I can't shoot it either. I mean, I fell for it last time. Wastelands. Um, what is over here? As I don't... Ah, this is Rustaletto turf. Let's talk. Fingers is jewelry. Great, great. Um, I wonder if I can talk to this guy about anything. Hmm. Negotiation? You care to negotiate? You look like a shrewd businessman. Take off or I'll feed you to the boss. Yeah, okay. Who is your boss? I don't know. I don't need any of your crap, buddy. I am getting grenaded heartily, but with my increased armor and body stats, I seem to be making it through, sort of. Half of least resistance, my ass. I'm going to be using all kinds of resistance. Aggressive resistance. Don't make me use this gun I have. I just bought it and I'm itching to get some mileage out of it before I upgrade it for a shotgun or an assault cannon or something. Which are things that you can get. Nope. Why don't uh, you hold your aim a little bit better there, buddy? By buddy, I mean myself, not the other guy. He ain't my friend. I don't know him. But hey, the money's pretty good. So if these guys uh, come back, I could grind here for uh, even more cash, which would be great. Let me guess, this is where I use that key. It's an iron key. 
Ah, good, I do have a slap patch left. I'm just gonna use it now. On myself. Because I have a feeling that this is gonna get dicey. I may have to flee. Oh good, I only have to fight one of these yokels at a time. Yeah, you hit that wall. I'm hitting the wall too. Alright. I like to think I have partial cover, but I don't believe that's the case. Yeah. Where's my money? Wow. I guess I can't just dodge around fast enough to avoid getting hit altogether, which is a shame, because, you know, I was hoping. Who is even shooting me? Is it you? Looks like it's you. I am getting a buttload of experience. Oh, hi guys. How you doing? Yeah, you feeling alright? Um, did you remember to tip your waiter? Be sure to catch the 5 o'clock special. I am going to need to flee. Fleeing seems like a viable option. But I'm having a boatload of trouble actually hitting these dudes. Let me grab my money. Itch my money. Finish this one off first, I believe. I changed my mind. Oh, I hope this alleyway doesn't uh, come back full force. Yep, that's definitely a guy in the trash can. So you know what this means. This means that, once again, I get to go back the way I came and continue to try to heal up. This is getting ridiculous. But at least I'm getting lots of XP. Let's quickly get to the station. And I will meet you back here again, 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 and again. Okay, build myself up, up to my body stat again, bought myself some slap patches, I'm feeling pretty good about this. I think we got this. You know, we just gotta get past those two bodyguard orcs, and possibly the entire rest of the city, if they came back. I ain't dealing with that right now. Ain't nobody got time to deal with that. So... Apparently, they do not uh, come back, which is kind of a shame because I was hoping I could get plenty of money out of it, but um, I guess that's not where I get to grind. Alright. These dudes are hard to hit, but I might be able to outlast them. I hope. Probably should have just saved up and bought the shotgun or the Warhawk from the start. But I didn't really think the things were going to be going like this. Now I know better. Should probably hire some people to help me out with this kind of thing. It's a little late now, I'm too infested in this fight far too invested in this fight. I mean, look how far I've come already. I've hit him, what, maybe a dozen times at least? Maybe? Possibly? Maybe not. I like it when I hit the orc several times in a row. They must have some damn good armor. Is that what makes them ferocious, knowing that they can soak a boatload of damage? If I can get the first one dead... Yep, okay. 
Now I definitely know that I can finish this one. There. It's probably easier to hit at this range. And apparently it's not easier for the orc to hit at this range. I don't understand it. But you know what? Not my problem. Now I finally get to see what's in here, but first, let's look around the building. Um... Moo? Ah, just like your mother said, Trebek. I am not seeing... KF rule. Okay. Duly noted, friendly wall advice. I don't really see anything out of the ordinary here. Um, I think I might want to revise that assessment. I did buy some slap patches, which is fortunate because I need them immediately. I hope this is going to be enough. I better use, like, all of them. And they said that you wouldn't really need to hire people this early in the game. I find that hard and difficult and hard to believe. Two more. I'm gonna feel ridiculous if it turns out I wasn't even supposed to come this way. Alright, if I can just get, like, one of them out of the way. Specifically, the one that's repeatedly stabbing me. That would be kind of nice. I can't even kill this one guy. Neat. Great. Awesome. Swell. And now I'm dead. <sighs> you know, sometimes... I wonder what the hell I'm even doing in this game. Clearly that was the wrong thing. But what else is there to do? I just don't know, man. I just don't know. Oh, right. I, uh, didn't save after buying the slap patches. Well, I got a lot of stuff that needs to be done before I can take on that area, or I'm gonna have to find a different area to take on first. Or I'm gonna have to find a bar that I can get more information at. In fact, I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing at this point in the game, except finding someone who can access my head computer, but, um... Having trouble thinking of leads, so maybe something will occur to me before the next episode. Until then, thanks for watching. This is your old pal Rosser. Take a drink.